It's got news, but I don't know how to feel about it. Alright, lay it on me. Before I met Joey, I was a writer and an editor. You know, I, I went to school for it. I did some good internships, I landed a few good jobs. But when I met Joey and we got married, I wanted to start a family and I became a stay-at-home mom, by choice. But once he left recently and abandoned us, I started applying to those writing jobs again. And I didn't think I'd get anything because of my experience being years ago. But I landed an editor job at a small publishing house. I had no idea you were a writer. That's really cool. Are you serious though? You went on an interview and everything? Yeah, it was a, a virtual interview. I was, I was against like several other people and, and I got it. Well, look at you. You still got it. Congratulations, that's, that's really great news. You can, you could probably get your own car now. You don't have to worry about money as much. Yeah, I, I can't, I can't believe this. Good things happen to good people. You don't need your husband's money to survive. But why don't you know how to feel about this? Because yeah, I just landed a 40 hour gig, you know, and it's paying great. But I also have Junior and he didn't start school yet. Um, I, I just, I'm scared that I'm not gonna be able to do it by myself, you know? Well, I know you don't like to take handouts, but until Junior starts school, you have plenty of people willing to watch Junior during the day. And there's no shame in it because you're out there making your own money. You're out there providing for your son. You, no one else. Yeah, and I know it's the one aspect I shouldn't like focus on because it doesn't matter. He doesn't matter, but it pays more than Joey's old job. Like I, I'm making a lot more than he did. And I guess I'm just proud that you know, he left me, but I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> I landed on my feet, you know? No, it's completely fine to think that. You should be proud that you make more than him, especially after he left you. And he always seemed like the type of guy to throw money in your face. Now look at you. And you know, if you ever want me to watch Junior during the day, my schedule's all over the place, so I could always fit him in. I'm gonna have to find, um, I'm gonna have to find outfits to, to wear to this place.